day we found a way to get a season three lobby early. On top of that, Fortnite messed up and someone leaked the entirety of season three. From a map leak to event spoilers and so much more, someone's gonna get in trouble. Here's every single leak and a lot of these are already confirmed showing that this is very trustworthy. The sisters are traitors and give the IO important information. How does this make sense? The sisters were always good, right? We are learning more and more every single day about Paradigm and the evilness behind her. Here are all four of the skins who are going to be piloting the mech and Paradigm is on the other side. She looks completely evil now. But why would the sisters be evil? Is there a possibility that Paradigm is able to communicate with members of the Seven and she is manipulating the sisters, convincing them to join the IO? If the sisters are traitors and they give the IO important information, what info did they give? Keep on watching to find out. We see Sloan talking to someone in a flashback. We can't see him, but Sloan seems to be afraid. Talking to someone in a flashback, who could it be? It was revealed months ago that Midas is not dead and he is still alive, according to Donald Buster. The first ever Doomsday live event happened almost two years ago because of Midas. It was his master plan. But wait a second, Midas has not been involved whatsoever in the recreation of the Doomsday device, the Doomsday device 2.0. Why is this? And if Midas is not dead, why is he so quiet, no one is talking about him, and why is he not involved? The reason for this is because Sloan is not involving Midas whatsoever in the creation of the Doomsday Device 2.0, and he is very upset. Let's just say Midas messed up very badly, because obviously if Midas is not involved, how did Sloan know how to make a new Doomsday Device without his help? Because after all, Midas has all the smarts. Midas wants his revenge, and the reason for that all relates to Midas' restaurant. If you don't know, if you go inside of the restaurant itself, you enter in these doors, and you look on this table, you can see the blueprints of the Doomsday Device 1.0. Completely how it was built, how it operated. For the past month, Sloan has been moving all around the map, and nobody knew why. I think the reason for it is she wanted to know what created the Doomsday Device and she finally found it inside of this restaurant. Do you think that theory is true? Comment down below. So Sloane is talking to Midas in the flashback. We can't see Midas, but Sloane is very afraid of Midas because he wants his revenge again. Two years ago, there was a tsunami, and now this tsunami fully relates to the scene and the overall theme of the next Fortnite season. What if I told you this was a huge, huge flood, and now we're going to get a drought? The water all across of here is fully draining and nobody knew why, but now it's fully making sense. The Doomsday device is draining this water. That is why there's also a huge barrier across the map and that's why Loot Lake itself is going to be fully drained. Any water that was on the Fortnite Chapter 2 map is what caused the Doomsday device to fail. It triggered a flood and now, Slow knows if there's no water on the map, the Doomsday device will be able to successfully launch and, and they can fully execute their plan. The device ends up failing though yet again. However, the device absorbs the energy of the storm and overheats. This causes an explosion. If all the water's gone, it's gonna turn into a desert. That's why Fortnite Season 3 will be called Drought. Almost all of the water will disappear. The storm is now red and a heat wave. I have no idea if this is real, but apparently this is footage of someone glitching and getting the red storm early. This apparently happened to their game. I don't know if this is real, but this apparently showed up. It is completely red. You can see the crazy glow. I don't know if this is season three or not. I don't know if this is fake. I found this on Twitter, but now they're going to go inside of the storm and let's see what it looks like. This looks fully insane. They are in the storm. Real or cat? I have absolutely no idea. Comment down below. This only gets crazier. If you go to the new collider location, apparently this was added today. Fly into the collider three times. It's it could be cap. I don't know. One, two, three. You will be teleported to this strange location. I don't think this is real. There's no way. The same location as the lobby background. It looks like a creative map to me. Let me know in the comments, real or cap. I think this is fake. But later in the video, I'm going to show you how I got a season three background. Volcano will return. A certain someone will be there, not Indiana Jones. We know that in Fortnite Chapter 1, there was a volcano eruption, a live event with a crazy volcano. What if I told you I have proof of how the Chapter 3 
three season three volcano is going to look like it's going to look a lot different from this one on screen right now it's not what you think if you look at the fortnite season three leaked battle pass does any skin stand out to you for someone who might be at the volcano you are looking at him right here darth vader if you were not aware, this is Darth Vader's castle from the movies, and you can see that they are fully living on a volcanic planet. So yes, we are getting another volcano, but it's not going to look like the chapter one volcano. It'll be a POI called Darth Vader's castle. The entire map is going to turn into a desert. There will be water supplies which heal you, which is weird because in season two, they added sprinting, but there's no hunger, there's no thirst bar. You never really get tired from sprinting. Since we're gonna be in a desert and it's going to be very dry, imagine if Fortnite adds a hunger bar and a thirst bar, and you have to remember to eat meat and drink these brand new water items or else you will get tired before we show a leaked season three map you watching right now subscribe to the channel or else you will miss the season three live event don't want to risk it and that's a new way to get eliminated besides this new red storm this only gets crazier fortnite content creators everywhere have been getting these leaks sent directly to them from fortnite let me fully explain what it is right now you can see obviously this is in space and then all of a sudden there's a cursor there's another cursor double the size going towards some sort of target right here this image isn't fully created yet this is the loop of the entire fortnite island this is the target where these two cursors are going and this is the zero point in the center but if this is you the person playing the live event who is this since the second cursor is double the size as the first one could this be the fortnite robot on your team and in the live event we're gonna see the robot enter the loop comment down below your thoughts here's a moment where i loaded into fortnite and i had a season three lobby let me show you what happened and how I did it. I'm not joking. Inside of the Fortnite lobby, when it loads, I have something Fortnite Season 3 related inside of the lobby. I'm gonna show you guys in a second how I did this. Come on, connecting. We have arrived to the moon. Although it says Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 2, we are literally in a moon background. I'll show you how I did this later, but first, let's look at the possible leaked map. You're on the surface of the moon. You can see a different planet in the background with this live event timer, even though it does say Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 2. This is not the confirmed real lobby of season three there is a possible map leak of fortnite season three i don't know if it's real though this is where it gets crazy responding to all of these leaks we don't know if they're real obviously someone said some of these correspond to this leaked map of season three but nobody knows if this is real three two one let's hit show this is a very blurry image things look pretty similar except for the center of the map where loot lake is it looks like there was a huge explosion which fully relates to what it said in the leak could this map be real? Comment down below your thoughts. Okay, here's how I got a season three lobby. We're inside of a Fortnite folder. And as you can see, there's images from the live event. There's one. Here's another. This is honestly so sick. But you can see one image in particular. If I click on it, this is the lobby itself. The fully constructed robot. And this is all I did to get the moon. I put an image of the moon inside of this folder. Then I renamed it to the robot image. And now I have a moon lobby. This is so cool to troll my friends. Subscribe right now if you're excited comment down below what you're gonna wear during the live event this is gonna be epic